Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be opening the 2024 Hot Wheels International J Case. So let's get started. The regular treasure hunt for this case is a Honda Super Cub Custom. And the Super Treasure Hunt is a Mitsubishi Pajero Evolution. Previously, I've opened up every other case available so far from A through H. Links for those videos are in the description below. Our first car up is a West Coast Flyer. This is in what? This is from, I think, the A case, if I'm not mistaken. Next up, a 1964 Chevy Chevelle SS. I think we got one of these out of the previous case. I really like this car, it's a nice car. All right, and now we have got a mod rod. This is a recolor, this is light blue. The previous color was a Metal Flake Silver, and it's gonna come out in a third color later this year. I just don't know what the name of that color is yet. Next, we've got Meld It. This is a kind of a souped up mail truck. And if you look real close on this, it's got a bunch of graffiti all over it, which is kind of cool. This is new for this case and it's new for 2024. All right. Now we have got a tuned Mazda RX-3. This is in yellow, and I believe I got one of these at the previous case, if I'm not mistaken. All right, and now we have got from the Fast and the Furious, a 1970 Dodge Charger. And of course, this is a tuned version of Dom's Charger pretty cool looking this is in black this has been in production since 2003 and can't really see on this but something kind of cool about it the window on the passenger side is up but on the driver side the window is actually down All right and now this is a recolor this is a custom 68 Camaro this is in white The previous one was in red. I like the red, but I really like this white. I'm not sure which one would be my favorite. I don't know, I, I really like that white. Next up is Speed Bump. Now, this is pretty cool. I don't know that I've seen another Hot Wheels car that's like this. It's a crushed vehicle. Um, and this is part of the Art Cars series. Um, this is technically a unlicensed vehicle, but it's actually based on uh, the 1984 Oldsmobile 442 casting. I like this. All right. Next, we have got Donut Drifter. And this is from the Netflix Hot Wheels animated TV show, Let's Race. And so is Speed Bump, by the way. All right. This is T-Rex Droyer. This is a recolor. Uh, this is blue. The original uh, color for 2024 is red. This is another car from the Netflix Hot Wheels animated show and wheelie chair now wheelie chair here is also a recolor but this isn't it and now we've got a garbage truck this is called total disposal it's pretty cool looking this is in white this has been in production since 2020 
And now we've got a 1976 Greenwood Corvette. We've got several of these Greenwoods. They're pretty nice looking cars. And we've got another West Coast Flyer. And we've got Hotwiler. And of course, this is inspired by a Rottweiler dog. Uh, kind of a cool thing about this, um, the front end, when you drive the car, um, the front end open and closes, uh, chomps up and down. Okay, and we've got another speed bump. And again, that's from uh, the Netflix show. And we have got Speed Dozer. This is a souped up bulldozer. This is in green. Pretty cool looking. And it's another that is featured on the animated show. And now we have got Glory Chaser. This is in this nice gray color. Next up is another 64 Chevy Chevelle SS. Really nice car. This is one of my favorite cars for 2024, I think. And I love that red. All right, we've got an 87 Dodge D100. And actually, this model Dodge was the first Dodge to use the Ram name. And we've got another one of the custom 68 Camaros in white. This is Group C Fantasy. And this is in kind of this teal and purple, which looks pretty cool. I've got this in a couple different colors. And it's also from the Netflix TV show. All right, next we have got a 1995 Mazda RX-7. This is, uh, this is nice, I like the RX-7. And I like this model year, or, or kind of this generation, not necessarily the 95, but uh, kind of the generation uh, with it. Um, this is in white. This is new for this case. And again, this represents a third generation uh, RX-7. And this casting has been in use since uh, 2017, I think. And now we have got a GMC Hummer EV. This is in purple. Next is a Honda Super Cub Custom. And this is the treasure hunt for this case. You can kind of see the treasure hunt logo there. And you can see the treasure hunt logo on the card underneath. It's pretty nice. Um, this color is called Metal Flake Gray. The real Honda Super Cub Custom Motorcycle has actually been in production by Honda since 1958. And this has been uh, a Hot Wheels casting since the early 2000s, like uh, maybe 2002, 2003, something like that. And now we have got Later Crater. Uh, this is kind of cool. This is uh, also from the Netflix show. This represents a um, space vehicle, like, you know, something that you would drive on the moon, uh, hence the name Crater, later Crater. This is new for this case, and this color is called Aqua. And now we've got Rock and Railer, another one from the Netflix show. This is Birthday Burner. This is new for this case and new for 2024. Um, I'm not sure what the color of this is called, but I would say chocolate because it's like a chocolate cake. Um, kind of a interesting, interesting design. I love cake, so I should love this car. <laughs> All right. Now we have got a 
Batman, Arkham Knot Batmobile. Pretty cool looking Batmobile. This is from Batman Arkham Knot. And next we have Proper Chopper. This is in yellow and um, kind of a light blue. And now we have a King Puda. This is another art car. I got this in one of the previous cases and I really like this. This is a nice car. I just, I really like the red and white with this thing. It's sweet, really nice car. All right, we have got a 1966 Triumph Tiger 100. This is another motorcycle and it's actually got a rider on it as opposed to the, most of these motorcycles don't have a person on them. That's kind of neat. Um, this is in white. This is a new 2024 model. And of course it's new for this case. And now we've got a yellow Corvette C6. Like the Corvettes and I really like this and I like the C6 Corvettes. Next up is a 1963 Studebaker Champ. I think I got one of these out of the last case. It's a nice truck. And now we have got a Pagani Zonda Art. This is in yellow. And uh, this is actually recolor. The color is actually not called just plain old yellow. It's, um, and I may be saying this wrong, but I think it's called Jalo Ginevra, um, which roughly translates to Geneva yellow. And it's also available in a second color called Verde Forenza, which means green Florence. I probably butchered how those were said, but it's as close as I'm gonna get. Next car is stuck. This is a Baja Bison T5. This is a recolor. This is in red. Uh, the previous color was black. This is also featured in the Netflix Hot Wheels TV show. All right, so moving on to the second half of the case. Okay. First, we have got Duck and Roll. And technically the color on this is called Glow in the Dark. Oh, and they've got it called Glow in the Duck. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Like this. All right, next we have got Dessert Drifter. This is another car from Netflix. This color is called Transparent Teal, and this casting has been made since 2003. All right, and now we have got a McLaren Solus GT. This is in orange. This is also a recolor. Um, it's not a recolor for this case, but it is a recolor. Uh, the first color was a blue. Um, I prefer this orange. All right. And we've got another GMC Hummer EV. This is a Volvo P1800 Gasser. This was a previous treasure hunt that I didn't get, unfortunately. The treasure hunt um, looks a lot better than this. And um, super treasure hunt, rather. All right, this is Road Bandit. This is in this uh, metal flake green. It's another car that's featured on the Netflix Hot Wheels Let's Race animated TV show. This is based on a jeepney. If you don't know what that is, Google it. 
That's spelled J-E-E-P-N-E-Y. Jeepney. All right. And now we've got a 1969 Mercury Cougar Eliminator. And it's, there we go. That is nice. I like this. It's a nice color. So the color is Metal Flake Aqua. And then later this year, it's going to be released in a dark green. I can't imagine the dark green would look any better than this. This is, this is nice. And we've got another Road Bandit. And we've got a 2007 Chevy Tahoe. It's a nice looking car, but if you've listened to any of my previous videos, you know how I feel about the plastic bodies. And now we have got a 1957 Jeep FC. FC stands for forward control, and that's basically just a, a cab over um, truck. Got another one of the Arkham Not Batmobiles. This is Mad Mike Drift Attack. This is in Metal Flake Blue. Previously, this was released in Matte Gray. I think I like this blue better. And we've got another birthday burner. Another Volvo P1800 Gasser. Another 76 Greenwood Corvette. 2015 Mazda MX-5 Miata. This is in orange. I may have had one of these earlier, I don't remember. Anyway, it's nice. And we've got a McLaren P1. This is in Metal Flake Blue. This will probably be the only P1 that I ever own, considering they cost $1.15 million new. This is Rowan Solo, another car from the Netflix Hot Wheels TV show. And we've got another McLaren Solus GT. And another Mazda RX-3. And another Batmobile. This is a DeLorean Alpha 5. This is a recolor. This is Metal Flake Orange. The previous color was just black. It's a nice looking car. Okay, now we've got a 2010 Camaro SS. And the card is bent on this one. That kind of sucks. So this is nice. This is also a recolor. Uh, this is in white. The previous color, I think, uh, yeah, it was a lime green. I like this white much better. Now we've got another 57 Jeep FC and another 66 Triumph Tiger. This is a Porsche 904 Carrera GTS. I got this out of one of the previous cases. Very nice looking car. And we've got another Meld It. Another Porsche 904 Carrera. Another Roland Solo. This is HW Ultimate T-Rex Transporter. This is another car from the Netflix show. And we've got another 87 Dodge D100. 
This is a Mercedes-Benz Unimog 1300L. This is in green, metal flake green. Uh, this is also released this year in Zamac. I think that is a Walmart exclusive. All right, we've got another Studebaker and another King Cuda. Another later crater. And lastly, we have got a, another MX-5 Miata. I think my favorites out of this case is the duck and roll, primarily because it's glow in the dark, which I think is pretty sweet. I like the recolor of the 68 Camaro. I like the Dodge Charger tuned. I have to like the Honda Super Cub, considering it is the treasure hunt. I like the 2010 Camaro SS, but I think my favorites out of all of this is the speed bump, which is just pretty neat. But I really like the Mercury Cougar Eliminator. I think this is my favorite out of the case. Which car is your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. If you haven't already, please consider liking and subscribing, and I will see you in the next video.